tonight, the U.S. Navy is confirming a Westlaco native died in the USS Fitzgerald collision off the coast of Japan. That collision happened Friday, U.S. time. Channel 5's Stephen Sarabia has the details. Commander Ron Flanders, spokesperson with the U.S. Naval Forces in Japan, tells Channel 5 News gunner mate second class Noe Hernandez is one of the seven sailors who died in the collision. Commander Flanders tells Channel 5 News Hernandez was in the berthing space of the ship when it was struck by a 30,000 ton cargo ship. It happened around 2 a.m. Saturday Japan time. Commander Flanders tells us Hernandez was likely asleep when the collision happened. We reported Friday the USS Fitzgerald was struck by a container ship. The container ship's bulbose head plowed right into the crew's living quarters, giving sailors just minutes to escape. The crew shined in this in this moment and, and kept the ship afloat. Uh, unfortunately, two of the ship's crew berthing spaces where the sailors were sleeping were flooded and seven sailors were trapped inside and were lost at that time. Officials are now questioning what the container ship did moments before hitting the USS Fitzgerald. Multiple maritime trackers show it completing a U-turn minutes before the collision. The U.S. Navy is launching an investigation. In the Channel 5 News studio, Stephen Sarabia, Channel 5 News this weekend. The Navy is planning a memorial service in Japan next week. Commander Flanders says the Navy's first priority is to take care of the victims' families and the surviving crew aboard the USS Fitzgerald. The U.S. Coast Guard and Japanese Coast Guard also investigating.